Welcome back to Let's Play LNOR. This is Nicholson Electroplating, our penultimate case of the entire game. This is also our last DLC case, too. Hmm, okay. So while Jack's setting things up for the final case of the game, Cole Phelps is still doing police work. We go after the doctor and some of the other guys. But the whole department breathing down our necks. It's time for There's not much we can do, but I mean, well, hey. Jack's crossed the Rubicon, and we have to be on the other side. Whoa! What was that? <laughs> what? Something big. Think it's the Reds? Oh no! H bomb on us. Calm down, Herschel. We need to be ready for that. That, that, that was not an H bomb, but that was something. That was something big. Well, all right. This is Jesus. This is completely unrelated to the Legion Fields or whatever's going on in the main game. This is all by itself. This is, this is, you know, a DLC case and all that. And I freaking love this case! God damn, that's one way to start a case. All right, I, let's do it. I wish a lot more cases were like this case. This might be my favorite one, actually. So first off, we get, we get a mad dash oh right into the blast God. scene. My God, look at this! <laughs> It looks terrible! Oh my god, the carnage, the destruction! Everyone's dead! Hell. Oh my god! Cuff them or put them down. Oh my lord! Cuff them or put them down, huh? You give me the option, right? Or put them down, huh? So, hey. Okay! Uh, I gotta I, hang on! Wait, there! Wait, sit there! <laughs> uh, stop! Okay! Got him! God, okay, answer me this. Okay. Is this in like a separate universe? Because there is no way Jack Kelso is running around and not hearing this. Jesus. Well, he's 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 doing other stuff. He might be unconscious right now. Oh my God, you're right. Mom's gone off. Jesus Christ. Why did nobody mention it though? Because he'd be sleeping so hard, not even a bomb could go off, and he'd hear about it. That's a heavy sleeper. Oh no! Uh. Oh no! Oh, the Warner Brothers are going to get out! I think the Warner Brothers did this. And the Warner sister. They're menaces to society. No wonder they were locked up in the water tower. Yeah. The dark gritty reboot of the Animaniacs. <laughs> no! Yeah. Everything about the movie is dark and gritty, but except for the Animaniacs, <laughs> they're, so, they're still the same. I have an idea of what might have caused the explosion, but I'm only guessing. Have a look around the rubble, see if you come up with it. Hmm. Yep, well, it definitely right. looks like an explosion. There's a lot of clues around here, a lot of stuff to find. Let's get to finding some of that job. stuff. First thing to notice here is we have at least three confirmed victims. They're singed too. They're gone. Ugh. Ugh. They carnage. Vaporized. Yes, that is a good word used to describe these victims. Oh, brother is right. Uh, the thing about this crime scene is that it's very big and open, so there's like a lot of stuff that you could miss. Right, right. Well Dv Crew, excuse me. Much, Walk right in front of the guy interviewing the mayor. Mm-hmm. Something down here. Oh, hang on. A tattered shirt. Oh my god, this looks like from an employee of Elysian Fields. Superior laundry. Well, nothing pointing to Elysian Fields yet because this isn't their MO. They 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 take out the their their shitty green lumber homes. They don't take out entire Electroplating plants like this I was with about gigantic to say, explosions. It's, it's, this isn't what they do. <laughs> if they start like buying up bits and pieces of the city and start, you know, rebuilding with their shitty homes, and then drop a bomb on them, they could just be like, "Those gosh darn Japanese!" Hey, detective, <laughs> I think I got something here. Oh, what's this? I thought four of these was a hmm. uh, Any idea? This is? To to your to your right. To to your right. Uh, there is no way this thing is not just dust. Uh, uh, oh, uh, hey, there we go. Me like some kind An of achievement. The nose knows. 
So it's an airplane part of sorts. We'll look into that a little bit later, but it was apparently a big deal we found that. So could this be a plane that dropped in this area? I, d I don't know. I mean... How about this pristine shoe? Optimistic. Oh. I'm glad the plane missed the shoe. <laughs> or maybe the shoe was the cause all along. <laughs> it's... Yeah, somebody threw a shoe in the back of the plane, hit the captain, captain falls. Luckily, that plane was holding a bomb with the Elysian Fields logo on it, and then just all this blows up. Well, to speed things along, I'm going to use an intuition point and reveal all the clues here, so that way I can see what I'm trying to go for. Sure, sure. Because this is Cause, fucking huge. Yeah, this is, a, this is a gigantic crime scene. I mean, look how big the fucking explosion was. We got a locker in here, though. Oh my god, Indiana Jones! No, wait, that was a huh. fridge. Never mind. With a briefcase. What do we hey. got here? Hmm. This here is a. Ah! A camera? It's a spy camera! Only OSS agents oh my god, was this espionage? We'll need to get the film developed it might have been. <gasps> James Bond, why? We gotta we got develop the film on that, see what's on there. Uh, we got. Uh, Any oh, this or? is a bomb. Or a smoke and bomb, excuse me. Assumption. Don't know what that is. We'll keep hold of what that. A Ooh, a cipher. The Germans used them in the war. Hmm. They're cipher rings. Ooh, interesting. Them. Maybe they used them in OCS. Let's see here. These first letters of the cipher. The thing is, I, 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 I'm having a little bit of a hard time so. figuring out how this works. Yeah, good luck figuring out a cipher. I barely even know how to use one of these. I think they're fascinating. Well, we'll figure this out here soon. Right now, I'm just trying to figure out how to, how to like, how do I move it? Like, there's an inner wheel, and I don't know how to get to that one exactly. It's... Hmm. Can't... Well... I mean... So, K... S... Dude, am I doing it right? What are you... Hmm. <laughs> Herschel pushes you over... Let me do this, please. Be sure to drink your Ovaltine. Son of a bitch! Huh. Well, let me look at this other thing in here real quick, though. Hmm. Tomoko Akamoto. Japanese name. Tomoko Okamoto. He's a research assistant. She... So... Oh, I can move this inner dial. Ah, there we go. Ah, alright. So I guess I just line up the K with the H, but I can't tell where it is because my hand's in the way. <laughs> so move, move the whole thing around. Stupid hands. Go back to the inner dial. H is... K. Go back to the outer one again. And up we go. All right. Wait, so now we so got. So now we got to move it all the way over to K over here, with those uh, jumbled letters that are aside from the circle. Like, oh, see I, okay, I see now. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got you, I got you. So, start with K, N, starts with N, then over to S. It's V. There. Then B. E. Then over to O. R. And then J, very exciting. M. L. O. N. Uh, K. T. Q. And then X. S. And then B. North Avenue. Vermont, 133 North Vermont Avenue. Well, I'll be damned. Well, guess we got to visit there at some point. And we're done with the the uh, initial blast site. We got some leads to follow now. How exciting! I have no idea how we got those leads. I mean, everything should have been vaporized. Well, it's 1947. I mean. 
blasts aren't really that big. They wouldn't be that big until at least the 80s. Well, okay, you got me there. Oh, yeah. I'm Fred Nicholson. Oh, this okay, hang place? on. I guess I better it's interview this guy thing. first. It's Fred Nicholson. He owns the place. Work up that smoke. Oh. <laughs> Sorry about your place, man. Tell us what happened. So what the fuck happened? Remember, uh, Chief Chemist Harold McClellan was using this area to test the, the new process. Oh, so somebody exactly fucked up. This new process. They certainly it's, did. Uh, Classified information, son. Oh, bullshit. You're gonna tell me what happened. I'm prepared to go to the press and tell them it was your fault. What is the new process? I'm fighting an insurance fraud case right now, and I could just open and shut this if you don't help me right now. It's done by hand. It's extremely labor intensive. The process could be worth millions. Millions, you say? Millions? Dr. McClellan's personal assistant. She came highly recommended. Oh. Oh, yeah? Akamoto was involved in industrial espionage. Was she working for you? Well, Komoto! That's a ridiculous assertion. How can you possibly say she <laughs> No, a disingenuous assertion. How many of your other well, then why'd she get the spy camera if she wasn't a spy? Bags. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, she was selling me out. If she wasn't a foreign spy, who could she have been working for? She's working for Jack company. Kelso. But She's working for the Patriots. The aircraft manufacturers. <laughs> Try Excuse to me, sir. The philosopher's legacy. I was about to say, do you know what lolly lule lo means? What so where's McClellan, then? McClellan? A brilliant chemist. He's currently that pile of ashes over there. The yeah, what's left of him, at so least? no one has ever done this before. No, but... It is legitimate research. <laughs> so what? Could do what? Legitimate no research? Your place is gone. Risk. Look, he is a... was a <laughs> chemist. And his ideas could... <laughs> and now he's just vaporized. Mm. And you would be rich. I'm a of course I'd be rich, but electroplating would be brought to the 28th century. Blocks. You blew up six blocks. God knows how many people are dead. I regret that. That's laudable. <laughs> we'll be in touch. Whew, well, uh, g good talking with you, sir. I'm sorry about your place. Sorry about your vaporized employees and half the city blocks are destroyed. So, uh, later! The collar of a shirt. It has a laundry tag? Likely to be Dr. McClellan. So that laundry tag could belong to Dr. McClellan. 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 Whatever. All right, let's do it! Yeah, and guess what? No way. No hey, way. Give me a fire no truck! Way. Yeah! Yes! All right, let's go to our deciphered address, 133 North Vermont Avenue first. <laughs> oh my god, your yeah. partner's actually going to get it too. Yes, let's go. Let's do it. Cause some damage in this ruined part of town. Oh, dear lord. <laughs> do you have let's the sirens do going on right now? Yep. But let's uh, use the oh, phone real quick and see if we can't get an address for the superior laundry oh, place. Oh, right, right, right. You gotta call in and say, hey, give me an address. And then we'll um. put out fires by starting them. Detective Phelps, batch 1247. How could I help, detective? <sighs> of course, detective. <sighs> Tell them I have what I believe is an aircraft part. It's polished metal, light for its size. Well, while you're sleeping, we'll uh, see if we can't get some information on the part of the airplane we found in the, <laughs> the wreckage. <laughs> okay, I'll be late. I was paying attention. Yep. Anything else? I need an address for Superior Laundry Services. Closest store to your location is in Wilshire, 4766 Melrose Avenue. We, we've been there before, though. Yeah, we have. All right, here we oh. go. We're driving this. I damn it, we're driving this. We're gonna drive this to our uh, deciphered address. Let's do it. Crank those sirens and pretend you're about to take out some fires. God, what an obnoxious horn. 
Make oh, a little he... song. Any unit in the vicinity of citizen reports a 459. They're now in your area. Unit to handle, code 2 identify. I can see people on the sidewalk going, Oh, look, it's a fire truck and it's really annoying the siren. No! Oh. I, I am decimating cars with like one touch. Boom! Kaboom! I am unstoppable. So this is where we get oh, the achievement, right? <laughs> it's gotta be. Hello, car! Boom! Jesus! <laughs> yeah! Uh, Wait, yeah, what?! You broke it already?! It's already fucking up! Oh my god, these cars are made of, like, tissue paper. I would have thought that the fireman would... Yeah, would, that's, that's wheel broken. Stuck. That, sh that sure is a... That's a broken car. Oh, Come dear. on. You like to leave your mark, don't you? <sighs> Nothing is indestructible, my friend. It's gone. It's a fire truck. We're gonna it's, now to... it's now fire fucked. Yeah, it is. All well, right. hey, I'll just, I'll just uh, officer, borrow one of these. Excuse me, officer. I'm an officer. Please give me your car, officer. Thank you, officer. I'm the, I'm the one who diddled the German lady. Move. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there might be something in it for you if you give me a car, man. You can make a claim to the department. Could put some schnitzel in your stein, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> German things. <laughs> oh! Yeah, we're not going for it because, well, yeah, big, ex it. big explosion. I mean, why? There is no time. There isn't. There is absolutely no time to deal with minor, uh, minor misdemeanors. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, besides, let's go. Besides, I'm sick of the fucking uniforms spitting on me all the time when I answer those. Other side, it's I'm guessing. Be. Must be. I mean, I don't know where this address is, so I guess it's. Oh, there we go. Yep, there we go. Oh, right next to the Acme Corporation. This all makes sense with the Animaniac still. If Wiley Coyote calls again, tell him he needs to pay his previous invoice. Oh! Oh! I heard it! Huh. <gasps> oh, it's. Well, well. well that was easy. Akamato. Oh, it's Akamato, and also, uh, Jakush Swa, and also Dubois J. My favorite people in the L.A. Noir universe! Uh, uh, L.A. noir -y. Oh, they got, this place got fucked the fuck up, and oh my god! Oh my lord! So I turned the place over. You okay! That's not good. I'd like to think you would have had something more to say about getting shoved in a fridge or... Well, possibility, but let's take a look at him, though. I mean... Fucking hell. Oh, he's got ice growing on his eyebrows and hair and nostrils, so he's been in there for a good minute, at least. At least a day, probably. Hmm. God, how did we know his name so quickly? John Doe? Would have taken me years to figure that out. Clairvoyant like that. Is that another cipher I see? I don't think so. Oh, it's just a class ring. I like, I like what you're thinking, though. I like where your head's at. Because his here? watch is the cipher. Oh. On Jeans Lindbergh. Very expensive watch. Taken by fly boys. I always wanted I'm trying to see if it still works. It's not... That's yeah, funny. it's it's broken. As a kid, all I wanted was some food on the table. All right, let's have a look around here. Get any clues as to what's been going on. Oh, yeah, this place got fucked up. Try to get that thing. There it is. Da-da, da-da, da-da. Ooh. It is a tie pin you for retired members place. of the LAPD. Sure. That apartment gives you one of those when you retire. Something tells me Cole's going to be getting that a lot sooner than expected. Like right now, I'm sorry to tell you, Phelps. Yeah, that's yours. And there's one thing shining in the corner back there. <gasps> I know what that is. 
It's the other earring. We do that and boop! What? What is it exactly? It's microfilm. It's shrunk to the size of your thumbnail. Oh that's my! What's, that's why it's called a thumb drive. <sighs> hey! It's for finding all the clues in this room. In this Dude. room? Well, this this apartment. That's all. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Three North Vermont Avenue, Wilshire. We'll need an ambulance in the corner. Probably a team from technical. <laughs> Come on, let me use the phone. Come on, hurry up. Okay, let's go. Come on, God. I want to. I want to get that uh, sexy purple convertible we saw on the way over here. Hope it didn't despawn. Whoop! This is the way out. <laughs> He's so excitable, Cole Phelps is. Purple, purple car, purple car, purple, purple car. Well, I want to go and get a fucking purple car. Oh, look at that. Is it there? Oh, back there. Oh, that one. Yeah. Ooh. That looks nice. That's going to be fast. That's going to take us far. Oh, cool. It has a starter bomb. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to head to Superior Laundry Services, probably find out about this uh, Dr. McClellan guy or whatever. McClellan. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Get in! Alright, let's roll. Oh, no, not behind, not behind, no, no. Okay. Now, I'm looking to get this done as soon as possible. The game's almost over. we got no time to play around. <laughs> you still have time to be chastised, though. Of course. I mean, when you, when you drive passengers, it's not much to do but chastise. Just imagine if there was a partner who did that the entire time. Like, even if you were driving in a straight line, they'd say, you're not driving straight enough. It's like, my God, look at you. Where did you learn to drive? Can you drive any more erratically? I mean, come on. Now, how did you get your license? What's happening here? It's like, I haven't even gotten out of park yet! <laughs> and that's when you start having them, you know, run behind you. That's when I start reenacting Death Proof. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Son of a Bitch. Come on, Cole. This is a nice convertible, and you've completely destroyed it. Look, there goes the license plate. Well, good. Now they won't see who's coming. I'm oh, just thinking that sense. officer who was in the in the parking lot didn't even, like, try to stop you. I think he was running around because he was like, Oh, my God, the maniac's back. Oh, Nobody God. He tried to stop you. Oh, God, he had sex with a German lady. Oh, no. Oh, my God, he put his October in her fest. They made a great <laughs> beer. Hello! Excuse me, have you heard of an explosive new... Can you tell us who I belong to? I don't know where I was going Are you kidding? I got work to do, Mac. Here's the customer book. Knock yourself out. Great. Yes, do you have, uh... Do you have dry cleaning here? Do you have, a wet cleaning? Who is Hangstrom? Could be someone else from the factory. Officer Hangstrom has three jackets and a shirt. Came for pickup. Dead end. So that's a dead end for that lady. Damn. Thank you for all your. Oh, help, that was it. Sir. That was it. So we use this phone here real quick. Oh. oh well, okay. Message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Detective Phelps, batch twelve forty-seven. Message please. You need to call Ray Pinker urgently. Ooh. Ray Pinker. Haven't heard that name in a little bit. I got a message from Lindbergh Field. An airplane tech there identified your part. Oh. Oh, shit. It Maybe it was a plane that crashed. A Corsair or a B-50. Fits over the center of the propeller and protects the pitch gearing. Love how quiet these washers are. What? Could be, but get this. The Spruce Goose runs eight Wasp R-4360s. I think you better get over there and check it out. Hmm. I need an address for an Oscar Hanstrom. I don't have an address for... Oh. What? Uh-oh. 
a different name. So that must be a fake name then, this Hangstrom. No, you talking about the espionage case Inside having fake names? Fine. Where are we headed? Hmm. Well, this case certainly isn't over yet. Next time in L.A. Noir, we're gonna get to the bottom of it.